Once again, we've had a great day so far, and I'm sure the balance of the day is going to be as good. It is my privilege to welcome the chairman of OK Zimbabwe, Mr. David Lake, and his wife Beatrice, the chief executive officer of OK Zimbabwe, Mr. Willard Zareba, the chief operating officer, Mr. Albert Katsandi, and his wife Busi, the finance director, Mr. Alex Siavora, and yourselves, ladies and gentlemen. The 27th edition of the OK Grand Challenge is a reminder of the many years of an enduring partnership between the Mishonaland Turf Club and OK Zimbabwe. As always, this landmark is a big effort and, in, and this year it's even bigger and better in spite of the difficult operating business environment. It is the most celebrated family event of the calendar of horse racing in Zimbabwe. Indeed, it is one of Zimbabwe's major retail success stories of the past three decades. That this promotional campaign is an award-winning super brand is not by mistake, and that makes us proud because of the long association we have with this promotion. For that, we are indebted at MTC to the OK Zimbabwe Board and Management. With a record 44 cars in promotional prizes, plus an impressive 40,000 in stakes on offer, the OK Grand Challenge remains one of the most sought after events at the Borrowdale Racecourse from both consumer perspective as well as the racing standpoint. We are also cognizant of the commercial significance of this brand, OK Zimbabwe, as an entity. Therefore, we are committed to keep the extraordinary project viable. On behalf of the MTC board and specifically and pointedly the management at MTC, I wish to thank OK Zimbabwe directors and management for entrusting us with yet another opportunity to be a part of their grand promotion. To our stakeholders and the horse racing community, we register our profound gratitude for their continued support. We and the people of Zimbabwe at large and their support has been instrumental in the growth of the OK Grand Challenge and the horse racing in general. I thank you. Ladies, ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for Mr. Brian Black speaking on behalf of the Marshall and uh, Tough Club. We know that you are more than ready to start driving. So without much ado, I'm going to call upon Mr. David Lack to speak on behalf of OK Zimbabwe. Maoko, a round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. Chairman, stewards and management of the Matronland Turf Club, executives and directors of OK Zimbabwe, ladies and gentlemen. Today we have seen the running of the 27th OK Grand Change race day, which has in every respect lived up to the proud pedigree of what is a unique racing event. As always, the entire promotion has been wonderfully and enthusiastically well supported. Indeed, because of that support, this is without doubt the largest promotional event of its kind in Southern Africa. Over the past seven weeks, and despite the considerable challenges of the prevailing economic environment, our supplier partners have injected significant confidence with the scope of their participation.
They have brought exceptionally low prices to our stores, initiated multiple in-store activities, and provided prizes on an unprecedented scale. In this latter regard, a total of 44 vehicles will be won today, in addition to prizes already drawn, which included 10 premium residential stands, $25,000 in cash prizes, and free grocery vouchers. We are truly indebted to our supplier partners for the scale and enthusiasm of their support for our promotion. To Mr. Black, Mr. Mashangwe, and the rest of the MTC team, I offer sincere thanks for your organization of this great day and for their kind hospitality. With your help, the OK Grand Challenge has become a proud fixture on the national calendar, and we fully expect that this will be the case for years to come. I take this opportunity, too, to congratulate the owners of Yerman. They've had a wonderful win in this most prestigious race. Finally, I say to you, our customers, it is only through your continued and increased support that we are able to take this OK Grand Challenge jackpot promotion to ever greater heights. This is truly your promotion, and for some of you, it will yield life-changing rewards. We are most grateful for your patronage, your trust, your belief in our brands, and I wish you every good fortune in the draws to come. Thank you. Thank you very much. Mr. David Lake speaking on behalf of OK Zimbabwe. On that note, ladies and gentlemen, let's go straight into our actual presentation ceremony. May I please call uh, Mrs. Katsande, uh, the wife of the Chief Operating Officer of uh, OK Zimbabwe to come through and help us to hand over these wonderful prizes. As a big congratulations again to the host, yeah, man. And uh, if I may please quickly speak to uh, can we please speak quickly to the jockey, Mr. Quinton Riddle? Okay, I think they need you to come forward where the cameras can see you. All right, just very quickly, I'm very interested. Your, your, your host showed great character to win today, and I wanted to find out from you, did you expect this sort of run in a very competitive field of this nature? Yeah, TK, thank you. Um, you know, he won a good race in the tankard, and he's come through that run. Um, happy, fit, striding while at home. So I had great expectations going into the race today. Um, there was a lot of pressure, but the race panned out exactly as we had hoped today. And at the 300, when I showed him a gap, he took off. The afterburners came on and he took off. So, yeah, very grateful and blessed to be here. All right, congratulations. Two wins in a row, ladies and gentlemen. Let's give it up for Quinton Riddle, who is the jockey for the winning horse for today. Number one, who was Yemen. And there we go, getting his presentation from Mrs. Katsande. Thank you very much. Have we done our pictures? Okay. And then also, if I may please call again right now the trainer for our number one host, the winning host today. Uh, the trainer, St. John's Gray. He's in South Africa, okay. and the trainer that's looking after him, he's got to look after one of his horses that got injured. All right, if you may go ahead and just receive on behalf of our trainer. I've just been told that he's in South Africa, and uh, I'm sure he'll be very proud to find out that the horse won today two wins in a row. A big, a big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so I understand that the trainer is in South Africa. Is that so? So who are we going to talk to on behalf of uh, uh, the, the trainer? We wait to hear from uh, the big bosses. It's showtime, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, Grand Challenge 2015. All right, Mrs. Katsande is still here. Thank you very much. I think now we're going to speak to the groom 
uh, who is George Chenje. He's been looking after the horse. He's done a fantastic job. Sorry, Mrs. Katsan, I'm going to ask you to come back again so we can make a special uh, handover to the trainer of our winning horse today. Yeah, man. I think the ladies are going to come through. Can we have Quinton, Mrs. Katsande, and the groom, the winning team? Please, if you can just stand together here for our pictures. Uh, of the, yes, the team that got Yeman to win this year's Rose. Please, Rose Race, please just stand together. Here we go. Uh, if you can please just come together. Let's bunch up here. We're trying to take a nice picture to capture the winning team. Okay, and finally, I believe we're going to get the trophy. We're going to do a picture with the trophy. Uh, it is that moment that we've been waiting for. I know everybody is curious, trying to find out which car they're going to go with. But once again, let's give it up for the hard work that's been done ladies by this team. Please put your hands together. Here we go. This is it. If you can give a round of applause to this, that's the moment. The winner. The trophy, what more would you want? Shop Gallop and win, okay, Grand Challenge 2015. There Ma we go. Makoro Koto Amslope. And well done, there we go, the big trophy there. Okay, for the ladies that are here as well, I understand we've got flowers for all our VVVIP VIP ladies, please. Gentlemen, can we bring the flowers and let's make the flower presentation. I say thank you very much for your hard work and your effort. And it's great to see such a wonderful crowd turn up to one of the biggest, if the biggest race in Zimbabwe. I hope and pray, TK, that you are not looking forward to receiving any flowers this afternoon because you're not VVIP, my friend. You are talking. That's no flowers for you. Yeah. Well, well, I'll tell you what. I certainly can't wait to see who's driving away with the big double cab and also a record of 44 cars today. 44 so someone cars, 44 is driving away with something. CK. And I know some people are busy praying right now. They are saying, Yeshua Ngungua, Yadanda Kamirira, Yashika Chief, Uraima Tenga, Nikwanese, good driver, double cab, Continue praying. Can I 